Last week, our refrigerator stopped working. We took everything out of the freezer part of the refrigerator, we put it outside in the freezer, and then my daughter left the door open and it stopped working. Condensation built up around the coils and it stopped cooling. I sent Argelin down to the store to buy some coolers. We took everything out of the freezer and put it in the coolers. Not knowing if it would start working or not. We unplugged it, let it defrost. We went to the store and the guy said the delivery time was four to five days, so I bought a re little refrigerator to hold us over. We plugged the freezer back in in two days, and it started working. Well, we happened to come across a really good deal on a refrigerator, and I pulled the trigger. <laughs> <laughs> and my wife really wanted it. So bad. So bad. So I bought it, and here it is, Dang. with the monitor, <laughs> the family tub refrigerator. <laughs> it has all the bells and whistles. So, baby. <laughs> Wait, did you swipe it? Swipe it. So this is all our picture here. We've uploaded all of our family pictures. You can do a slideshow, so if you have a birthday party here, you can just put the picture here and just make a slideshow. Play here, like that. I don't know how many seconds to go. Go back to home. Yeah. What I like about it is it has YouTube access. We can go to YouTube. <laughs> We can play our videos <laughs> from our TV. How cool is that? <laughs> but what my wife really likes is the access when we're at the store. Yes, you can use your phone and see what's inside your fridge. So if we're not sure we've got milk, there's cameras inside of the refrigerator. Where are they located? It's on? over here. There you go. There's cameras inside of the refrigerator that shows us exactly what is in the refrigerator. So even we're anywhere in the world, we can get on the internet and look inside of the refrigerator and see what's in there. That's cool. <laughs> There you go. What else? Plus, I like this little drawer. Of course, my wife's candy stash. The shelves roll down. Yeah, you can put the shelf down. We've got an ice maker, crushed ice, cubed ice, <laughs> and water. Sample. There you go. Get over to crushed ice, cube dice. There you go. <laughs> it always drops onto the floor. Did you just see that? You have to be a little more careful. Yeah. <laughs> I recommend 4.5 stars for this fridge. So the only downfall was I had to make room in the wall for it to fit. Yeah, because it's kind of a little bit bigger it's than a, our It's bigger than the last refrigerator. So, there's our review. <laughs> Thank you so much for making that time. <laughs> I can't make it without you. All right, guys, so I'm gonna show you more features of this fridge. Well, my husband is picking those eyes there. Alright, so you can, you need to download application on your phone.
says Family Hub. Then you can upload photos here. And you can also see what's inside your fridge. Like that. There you go. So that's what's inside the fridge. And you can click that one and put it on your shopping list. Put the name on it. Or put the juice. I'm just going to put the juice on it. Could I spell it right? Underneath. This is a toddler lock handle. That's what it's called. I don't know how it works, but a young child cannot get into this freezer the way it picks up and pulls out. Yeah. There's a drawer here for your kids and stuff, and there's also a... Whoa. There's a big deep drawer down here. Yeah. Right, go back to my shopping list so you can click the th stuff inside there and put it on your shopping list it will just go through your phone so if you're on the store you can just look up on your phone and see what you need all right then and also this is my favorite part here the whiteboard You can just write anything you want here, like, whoops, I add, all right. There you go. And you can also use your phone and write stuff here. So when your husband or kids wake up in the morning, they can see this stuff in here, like that. All right, and this is one of my favorites too because there's a recipe there. There you go. Watermelon salsa, that looks so good. While cooking, you can also play this voice thingy here. I forgot how to select all, there's all the ingredients. This is the recipe. Oh, there you go. I'm going to play this. In a serving bowl, mix together the watermelon, there onion, you go. and chili pepper. All right. Season. Uh, I don't know what else. There's the weather timer. There's a lot of tasting stuff like that. So it's really, really cool. And I really, really, really love it. And thank you so much, darling. Peace, baby.